All right, it looks like we're ready to begin. Welcome everybody to today's final quick start on our tools and technology uh, other than Bouge. Bouge is something we teach in a special quick start, which will be held, uh, the final one for 2020 will be held on December 14th. You'll find registration links to that at soulsignblog.com. Today's quick start is the final recorded session for 2020. And we look forward to bringing you more of this again, twice a month in 2021. And as I introduced myself prior to our start, my name is Maureen Colvin. I am the manager of education and development for the New England region, but I'm very happy to welcome everybody from all over, wherever you may be signed in from or listening from or whomever may watch this recording at a later date. I want you to know I'm thinking of all of you and hope that you and your families are safe and healthy during this very difficult time for our nation. And I do hope that by this time or even sooner next year, we're all out and about and I'm able to get back in the classroom and teach you classes in person. So our agenda today is going to review Matt's Center and updating your profiles on it because that is important to making sure that your referral network is complete, that your Bouge CRM and websites are being fed the proper information so that when you take that class, you're able to utilize the platform right off the bat. We're gonna look at our tools, one of them, remaxhustle.com is where you'll be able to make your own commercials and utilize the marketing guide. That will be a takeaway from this session and anybody who registered for it will get that in a follow-up email. We're gonna look at design center automation, whether you've not yet heard of it or you haven't understood how well um, it's performing for you. I'm gonna review that in the automation portion of that platform. And we're gonna look at a couple of great tools we, use, we discovered in 2021 called the FIRST app and the Remax 60, 360 tool. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go through this presentation so that you can see it outlined bit by bit. But then I'm going to use the second portion of our presentation to go live and show you how we do this step by step. So you'll have two ways in which you can follow it. The first thing, as I mentioned, we want to ensure that you do whenever you come on board, whether it be joining Remax as a brand new agent to the business or just new to the company, you need to ensure that your Max Center profile is updated. That is going to feed your referral network. So people who are looking to send business in your direction or your vicinity are gonna check out the profiles of agent in the area. And sure enough, if you have no profile and no picture, just a balloon and you know your name and phone number, you'll easily be passed by. But if you've inputted a nice photo and lots of the information in your profile, it gives people a really good idea if you're the right fit for their client and you're likely to get many more leads that way. When you click on the update profile button shown here by the arrow, you're gonna come over to this general info dropdown. And it's gonna give you these columns or rows in which you wanna open each category and fill in the information. When I go live, I'll show you that a little more thoroughly, but just remember you want to open each of these boxes and fill in the information it's asking for. Be really thorough with your bio. That is what is gonna fill in the about me section of your website, as well as the overview of you on the referral network. You're gonna check and import more contact info to make sure people can reach you easily. Have a nice photo, high resolution. You want it to be bright and clear on your website. And then personal details that involve everything from your bio to 
uh, hobbies and community services, multi languages, anything that uh, would be more to make you more attractive to the consumer. As I mentioned, by filling in your Max Center profile, you are filling in this referral app. And I will open that for you and show you when we go live. But basically what you're gonna notice is that you can go in here and search by affiliates, offices, corporate. And let's say you had a client who was moving to Orlando, Florida. You would just simply type in the area and you would get a random listing these populate randomly, they're not in any order. And that is so that everybody gets a fair shot of being at the top of the list. And let's say you decide that you're gonna give this office a shot because it's right in Orlando. And when you open it up, it allows you options to look at the professional and personal details, how many agents, and then you can click on those agents and see what they're all about. So if I click on Peggy, I take a look and I say, gee, she's got a nice photo that tells me what she's about, about what her demographic might be for her clientele, how she licensed, how much experience. And then I would move down the page and decide if she is somebody that I think I'd like to make a phone call to. And I'd suggest you sort through the referral network and call maybe three people in the vicinity and do a little mini interview. And then when you decide who you think would be the best fit for your client so that they can be well serviced in their relocated area, you get the referral fee and they're still a happy customer. Because when they move, they don't take their entire sphere of influence with them. And if you did a, a nice job on your end, and then you referred somebody who did a nice job on their end, they're gonna recommend you to their family and friends who still live in your area. Once you have made that connection, you simply click the send referral button and you're able to establish the contract between you and the agent. And therefore, when that transaction completes on the other end, you've already got an agreement in writing between the two of you of how that is gonna play out. As you can see, you can have it, the drop-down menu, determine the fee type, percentage, and then you enter the client information. And when you're satisfied that everybody's in agreement and the fee has been put in writing, you simply hit the send button. Now, this is a screenshot of the Remax Integra US Resources Guide. There's also a Canadian version, and it is updated every quarter. And you can see this is the Q3, Q4 version for 2020. And I'm going to go into this live as well in a moment, but I'd like you to know that what this is is a PDF document. And even though a PDF typically is reading only, this one is very special because our brilliant marketing team put live links in it. So whatever is in the resource guide that you wanna choose as a resource, whether it be a tool or support uh, or a link to a specific folder, it is gonna take you directly through it so you don't have to go the long route sign into Mac Center, then find the uh, appropriate app and then go and know what folder to go into. Until you learn that process and that's very comfortable for you, this is a great shortcut and a great route to take. One of the things I mentioned to you, it will be in the resource guide, but remaxhustle.com is also just a website. You don't need a password you don't need to sign in. You simply go to www.remaxhustle.com and it will take you to the page where you can make your own commercials, hustle graphics, and welcome mats. Then those turn into PNG photos that you can then utilize in any way you would any other picture, whether it be in marketing materials 
social media, or print. Design Center Automation. Now, Design Center is a platform within Mac Center, and it has all kinds of marketing material templates for you to create on your own. But the automation portion, this is what I like to review to people because they might not realize that this is in play or they may have thought that when they received these emails from Design Center, they might have been an advertisement or just an update and they didn't realize they, had, they were being given this entire marketing package. So what happens is whenever any of you put a listing in the MLS, Design Center Automation is triggered. And within 24 hours, you will get an email letting you know that your Design Center automated package has been created for that listing. And then you can go into the package. The first one you will get is just listed. And you can go in there and look in, edit, and preview a for sale postcard, flyers, virtual tours, a website built just about that property, video, brochure. Now the information, photos, and text that these are based on came from whatever you put in the MLS. Let's say you got a flyer, but you wish it was a different photo on the front. All you have to do is hit edit and switch your photos around then you can utilize these marketing pieces in any way you choose. Again, for the same listing, if you were to change the price, you would get another email that gave you different pieces of marketing materials so that you could let people know there's an opportunity now to either relook at that property at a reduced price, or it might now be in the price point for a whole new selection of buyers. If you were doing open houses, and this could include virtual, you would just edit the text and let people know that it's a Zoom link, et cetera. But when you enter an open house in the MLS, the automation system once again will send you an email overnight and give you editable advertising pieces. So you can send that out to your sphere of influence, your database, whoever you know might be looking in that region, who might want to attend, et cetera. And then finally, the fourth package you receive comes in after you mark that property sold in MLS, and it allows you to advertise the fact that you've done a successful job. So for every listing in MLS, you get four pre-done marketing packages. The first app, this is, this is new in 2020, late in the season. And what it is, first of all, you get it free for the first three months. If you loved it, if you found it was bringing you new business, then you would be signed up for $39 a month after that. But if you try it for three months and you don't feel that it's giving you the bang for the buck, then you wouldn't sign up. And the, what is different about the first step? Well, first of all, it's different from a CRM because it basically is not a passive source for leads. It's not about automatic campaigns or passive emails or just um, suggestions on when to post things or newsletters. This app is a mobile app for examining your contacts that are already in your phone. And you can email a complete contact list to first and they will sync them to the app for you. So what you might have in your phone is a thousand names. If that's the case, the app is going to examine those people 
based on over 700 different data points. And it's gonna identify for you who you already know in your database that is most likely to sell this year. And talk about hot leads. Because what that does is it says, you already know these people, they're in your phone. And based on what their demographic is telling us, whether it be a job change or how long they've been in their home, or if they're coming out of college and might be looking for a first time home buyer condo or whatever the demographic and the data point show, the first app is going to star rate your contact base. And out of those thousand, you might only get a hundred that are starred. And they will be starred with either three stars, meaning they are most likely to sell this year, two stars, they're right behind the, the, that first group, and then one star, which means they're moving along the process, but they're probably not ready to be contacted. The app is a step-by-step -step task identifier. And the biggest difference is the first thing it's going to tell you is pick up the phone and have a conversation with these three star people. This is not about sending them an email or a postcard and waiting for them to contact you. This is about you following the first recommendations and picking up the phone to let's say five of your three star clients and just initiating a five minute conversation. And if you called five people on your three star list for five minutes, that's only a half an hour out of your day. And this is actually a perfect time to make those calls and approach with a conversation that might start with, I just came across your phone number and was thinking about you and your family. I just wanted to know how you're doing. Is everybody okay and healthy? And won't it be nice if that conversation evolves into this contact saying to you, this is crazy. I can't believe you just called me because we're actually thinking of marketing this year. Well, you already knew that. So the beta testing was very successful on this app. And just the, because it wasn't, um, it's not long-term out there, I do have one stat for you. And out of uh, data, by following the first stack recommendations, um, an agent who had a very successful business, uh, really most by referral, didn't really need to uh, dig deep for business, agree to be a tester and discovered that out of those phone calls, he got 18 coffee meetings that he didn't, wouldn't have known that were sitting there right here in his phone. And out of those 18 meetings, he got five listings. That is a considerable increase in income. So what that app will do after you make that first call, it's going to assign you another task. And it'll show tomorrow. And it's going to say, email that person you talked to yesterday. So you stay on track with the app recommendations. Follow them through. My suggestion is try it for three months. And then make a decision if you'd like to continue. Now, the Remax 360 tour came out promptly as COVID started to make it clear that we were gonna have to keep our agents and brokers successfully busy, but from a virtual standpoint. So Remax quickly sought out a tool that would help them to do that. And a wonderful company in London helped us create Remax 360 tours. It's based on iSpy. And what it does is gives a product to agents who want to utilize the platform so that they can do business completely virtually. 
it's a there's a best practice guide that you can download on Remax, and it's going to show you exactly what you need to do. It's very simple. Pretty much you take 10 photos. You can take a couple more if you want, but the first 10 photos cost $10. It's one photo, a dollar photo after that, but most homes can be represented very well with 10 photos. You can use your cell phone to take these photos. You get a little attachment and you might, they do suggest use a tripod to make sure your pictures come out nice and steady. You upload the images and send it off to the company. Within 24 hours, they're going to send you two branded two packages. One is Remax branded and one is unbranded so that it is MLS compliant. And you can utilize it on the MLS. It will include a 360 home tour, a 3D model of the home, interior uh, 3D model pictures, a floor plan and measurements. And I want to show you a, a little video. Well, first of all, this is the way you download this guide and it gives you this five step process on how to get started. But let's take a look at this video. If I can get it to play here. Hang on a minute. There we go. Welcome to iSpy Live, the evolution of iSpy 360. A milestone in design and technology, a world first. Combining 360 virtual tours and video chat to make what you already do better, faster, and more productive. iSpy Live is convenient. Customers can view properties in real time and instantly request an iSpy Live viewing. Engage with your customers at their convenience. Whenever, wherever they are, a revolution in lead generation. iSpy Live is cross-platform. Tours can take place on any mobile, tablet, or computer in any location. iSpy Live is user-friendly. It's simple. Nothing to download, nothing complicated. Just click and go. iSpy Live is information-rich. The feature-rich platform allows for a whole host of consumer-focused tools. Embed content such as Google Street View, photos, and documents. iSpy Live is immediate and social. Want to be proactive? Simply send an iSpy Live link to one or many existing customers. Invite multiple customers to your tour. Every house can be an open house without having to open the door. iSpy Live saves time and money. No more wasted journeys or viewings. Home in on qualified leads. Speed up the decision-making process. I Spy Live, say hello to the future. So that is an example or a nice overview of what you can see. And just I also wanted to give you this quick image of what the interior home model looks like. So as you can see, this mouse is hovering around. Customers can go into each room. They get a good idea if their furniture will fit. And you can even embed links into special features in the home, whether that be an incredible master bath or a chef's kitchen that has certain appliances that people might want to get more of a description on. Uh, does it does this particular fancy chef stove have the features and uh, utilities that I want? And this is a wonderful way for people to really see the interior of the home completely virtually as well.
And finally, before we go live, I just want to let you know you have more resources and support. Go to Max Center, check out these base knowledge release notes. It'll let you know when things are coming out, updates, et cetera. And in Remax University, you can review all the how-to videos you could possibly want, webinars recorded such as this one, guides. Just go into Max Center. The app is Remax University. And even you'll see plenty of links for all kinds of tutorials. But if you just type in something you're interested in the search bar, you'll get a whole selection to view. So what I'm going to do now is go live into a couple of the tools that I opened up in advance. And the first one I want to go into is the resource guide that I had shown you before. So now what we have here is the live guide. And as I mentioned, this will take you through an entire 60 page document. And it is going to allow you to go into our branding pages, our connections, and a whole slew of agent tools that I'm going to concentrate the most of. So as I scroll through, I want you to notice that each page has a big red link button. And this is where you will be taken. It's going to say, get the online resource guide by clicking here. And then this section is all about our commercials. If you needed to get into Mac Center, it's going to take you here. Always have your remax.net credentials signed in already and saved. That is the quickest way to get to Mac Center and open your dashboard. You can get broker and agent support simply by clicking on this big red button as I just did there. And it immediately brought me to a place where I am now live on the support website. I can submit a ticket and fill in the information that the support team is going to need to help me. And I got there simply by hitting the big red button. You will also see instructions on each page. You could go to maxhelpsyou.com or email support directly. Also, you might save time by simply looking at the knowledge base. The marketing portal is going to bring you places that you can get and download logos. You wanna always make sure you're in the up-to-date version and that the logo you're utilizing on your cards or your signs has been sanctioned to date. All kinds of slogans and downloadable graphics are in there. And like I said, I am going to show you um, the media on Remax Hustle. So those are the things we will be going over live in a moment. And again, logos and brand identity. If I wanted to find those logos, I simply click on the button. Because my credentials are saved, I'm just going to pop right in there. And here I have the place to look for all the 2020 campaign logos that I might want to use. And I have my choices of files, print and traditional, digital and social, ad campaigns. And as you can see, you can download different ones print them, download them to the web, the sign of a Remax agent, and there's many more. Design Center, we did review, as well as the automation. And we do have the same types of marketing and a separate resource guide that you can download for our luxury section. The remaxcollection.com has completely different colored branding. And there's this very easy resource to go in so that if you have a property that meets that criteria, you can easily utilize the marketing materials to well represent it. Our Remax luxury is brand new, beautiful guides and brochures available. Visit this website and look it over. 
There are downloadable brochures and social media, branding guides, logos, even realtor toolkits. Don't forget we are a commercial sale company as well. And there's many more resources to support those that do commercial business. And very unique to Remax is, is global.remax.com. It has certainly become a very small world. And if you think about it, now that many companies, if not all of them, has realized that they can have just as uh, productive a workforce that works virtually from home, regardless of where they're located, they don't have to be sitting in an expensive building in a city and they can save a fortune on those rents by letting their staff, at least the majority of them, continue to work remotely after the COVID crisis has passed and we're all able to be out and about again. So one of the benefits for, the, for you agents is people will want to now move to locations they may have always dreamed of living and say, I can, wherever there's internet, I can do my job. So I'm gonna go experience living in another part of the country or even another part of the world. What a wonderful uh, silver lining to this terrible dark cloud we've been under. This too shall pass. And when it does, this is an unbelievable opportunity for people working remotely in positions that allow them to do a very productive job from anywhere in the world or even is, even is uh, anywhere in the country just as effectively. And they're not only producing for their company, they're saving them a fortune by not having them uh, drive to an office and pay for all of those expenses. Don't forget about our Remax.com and the consumer mobile app. And as I mentioned, Remax University is chock full of resources for you to review anything else you might want to learn about. The Children's Miracle Network, if you participate in this, uh, this has nice resources, an agent guide that talks to you all about it, social images. If you participate in CMN, then you'll be happy to let your customers know that because there's definitely a demographic out there that would choose to do business with somebody who is working with the community and giving back. And the, uh, my understanding is there is um, an agreement where you would give $25 uh, per transaction to this, don to this uh, Children's Miracle Network. And that would allow you to become a miracle agent, let your listings be miracle homes. Many offices have already designated themselves as miracle offices. And to participate in that is a very nice thing to let your clientele know. We have the Remax Marketplace, Approved Suppliers. The branded URL shortener is in Max Center and we teach classes on what that does. But basically, if you were to create a website in Design Center that had a very long URL, you could shorten it here or even use it to interact with your consumer, create a little website for their home using the Design Center single property website builder. It takes about five minutes to build out, bring it to a presentation, and then just say to the consumer, look at, I already started to, uh, I've already created this nice website for your property. And I'd like to talk to you about what are the things you like most about it so I can go in and then add photos and edit it so that it really highlights the best features that you've loved while living here. So now that I previewed that for you, what would you like to name it? And then we'll both go advertise it to our whole spheres. Well, that's quite a nice assumption close because people see you've already been working for them. So of course, they're gonna to wanna to continue working with somebody who did that. We have an entire section on staying connected in this document. 
showing you what's coming up in education by sending you to soldsignblog.com. We have an entire updated hub on COVID and materials in which you can use to show your consumers that you're working within the strictest safety guidelines and some more information on things like Facebook pages to like and groups to join. And here is the section on the agent tools. Most of these we've already gone through, like the first app. And now Photify is another app you can sign up for. I suggest you go in and look it over. It basically creates beautiful instant promotional contact for new properties, open house invitations, uh, messages to new home buyers. It's very fast, it's mobile, it creates templates and it's nice and easy and it's really done in seconds you can shoot them right off you can also integrate these with megaphone which is another app i suggest you click in and watch the video on and as you can see some of our other tools will sync with it photify any pictures of your own and the remax hustle videos i'm going to demonstrate you can immediately use the megaphone app to turn them into social ads, web ads, and create some leads and awareness. We already reviewed the 3 Max 360, and you can get lots more wonderful information on the Together We Have platform, letting people know that Remax is here. Utilize the buyer and seller and staging guides that are wonderful. Uh, go in and look at these. The buyer's report card gives buyers an opportunity to really evaluate homes that they're looking at, whether they be virtual or in person, and come to a really educated decision as to whether each property meets their needs and wants and to what level it would make them happy. And then they rate the home. And then you can guide them with each property that they fill out this report card for and suggest that, you know, maybe if it's a not a five or above, then you just disregard it. But if they find something that's between a seven and a 10, you really might wanna look at that property closely and consider an offer. Um, most of us can't afford our dream house, which would be the 10 or it just is uh, not available or whatever the case may be but maybe a home with eight or nine doesn't need too much um, adjustment for that to turn into our dream house. So you like to counsel your people as to how to evaluate these homes. The seller's action plan is a wonderful way to gain intel as to what the seller's thinking about their property before you even do your presentation. If you can send this to them in advance or even have them fill it out at your first uh, sh showing of the home, your first introduction to their property. What it does is it walks them through room by room and helps them get a more objective view on their property. What are the wonderful things about it, but also what are things that might need improvement or might be outdated that might detract from its uh, peak showing capability. And it also will narrow it down and ask the seller what they want for showing timings and what, how do they feel about open houses? Do they want them? Do they just want virtual showings, maybe a hybrid? And then finally, it's going to say to them, what would you, cons what do you think your house is worth? Now, if you can get them to fill that out in advance, that is some incredible intel for you to know what kind of conversations you are walking into and therefore have time in advance of being hit with a number that you need to speak to off the cuff. They might be right on the money, which is an easy conversation. They might even be low and you're able to give them some better news, but often it's the other way and sellers think their property is worth more than you believe is fair market value. And you want to be able to prepare for that conversation so you can diplomatically and effectively help them come to that self-discovery. The Remax Home Staging Guide is a wonderful way to not only review for your own sake, but to let sellers take a look at and understand that minimal staging, even um, 
by just decluttering and removing a lot, moving a few pieces around can make a world of difference in how a home shows. We did review design center automation. And just some references here, to podcasts you certainly would like to listen to, uh, all kinds here, where now we're talking real estate. And here is the Remax Hustle page I am going to click into to take you right to this website where we are going to demonstrate how to send a welcome mat, create a hustle graphic, and build three different types of videos, as well as show you one that um, I'd like to end with. So we are again right here on remaxhustle.com. You didn't need to sign in, you don't need a password, it's simply a website. So when I say send a welcome mat, let's get started. Now, typically I would say you might wanna choose a welcome mat, create the PNG image, and send it off to welcome people to a newly closed property. And that is certainly still one of the best ways to utilize this tool. But I like to think of this time as a time for goodwill, where we wanna be letting our people know that we're really concerned for their welfare, that we're, we're really thinking more about them than about our business. Even though it's gonna bring us business, we want them to feel that we're just talking to them about the current situation. So we might say, we are all stuck at home. So let's choose the home sweet home uh, picture template and type in the client's name. And then I'm gonna add my name for my, as the agent and my office. As you can see, it's populating up here in the image. And I simply hit save. It immediately downloads onto my computer over here on the left is a PNG photograph. And there you can save it, pop it in an email to people, post it on social media. You might just put all my clients here if you were posting it to everybody or send it to families um, bit by bit. Maybe create 10 a day and send them to 10 different people. They only take a few seconds and you might just put a little note in there. I was just thinking about you, hoping your family are well and that you're able to manage all of the challenges that come with all of us being at home most of the time. I know you have children you're trying to teach and you manage your workload. Um, just let you know somebody's here thinking of you. Those little messages go a very long way. And people remember that you were one of the few that reached out to them. So now I wanna show you how to build a hustle graphic. And what this is, is basically a quick bio about your last 12 months in real estate. And it doesn't have to be with Remax, it could have been with a previous company. But what you wanna do is it's creating a very a uh, conversation starting visual, as opposed to just a text box. So let's see how many soul homes did you sell and how many buyers did you help? And did you perhaps work in luxury? Notice it's turning into these pretty visuals. How many neighborhoods have you worked in? And how many years experience do you have? Did you do any hope in houses? Now, if that question you feel doesn't benefit you, then just skip it. What's your favorite song to hustle to? I like to say, put something funny that's going to create some conversation. They're gonna say, hello, you hustle to Jaws? So just to bring, lighten people's day, how many miles did you drive? Now, if I were still teaching on the road, it would have been an enormous amount of miles. How many lunches did you eat in the car? How many miracle homes have you sold? As I mentioned before, you wanna let your consumers know that you give back to the community. And what's your favorite house, fa favorite open house treat? Uh, nobody cares how much coffee you drink. Okay, so now you're filling in your information. See how simple this is?
and you would obviously put your email. And in one minute or one second, I have this very pretty hustle graphic where I can save it again as a PNG image. And I like to say you should attach each, you should attach one of these to each feature sheet for every listing you have. If you're running an open house, make sure that you have this in a frame on a table right when people enter and to sign in and you can just say, hey, take a look at my most recent year. It gives you a little idea about uh, who I am and how, how I work for my customers. And I just thought it'd be a nice conversation starter. So back to the homepage where I wanna show you how to make these videos. Now you may have been seeing Remax videos on TV, Remax commercials, and they're advertising the brand. Well, we want to advertise the brand, but we also want to advertise you. So when the customer sees those Remax commercials on TV, and then you go and send them a Remax commercial about yourself, they are subliminally connecting the two and you suddenly look pretty powerful with that TV commercial. So let's look at the tools of a Remax agent first. I am simply going to fill in the blanks as it's asking me to, and it will ask you to. And you can see it's building out a business card. Now, if I was a collection agent, I would change the logo or commercial, but I'm just gonna utilize our traditional Remax logo. And it's gonna say upload a headshot. We all know you should have a handy headshot at all times. You never know when you need it in your marketing, keep them updated. And then when you find it satisfactory, you'll see that it populated and completed the business card. It also landed in the photograph in the background. And now you get to choose the fun stuff. There are 19 different value adds and for each commercial, you can choose three. When you choose the three, the others will gray out and you get to save them for another commercial. So you can imagine, you can get many, many different commercials with different themes out of this one particular tool. So let's say we want people to know about your year's experience and that they can purchase their home virtually because you use 3D home tours. And they can also close on the home virtually by taking advantage of your paperless transaction management system. The others will gray out and you get to choose some background music and simply hit create video. And here is your commercial. Look at all the things you can do with it. You can download it, create a Facebook cover video, copy the link, post it to social, email it, just about anything you would wanna do you can utilize this for. And our marketing team being what they are, they understand that the attention span of the consumer is very short. So you're gonna find these videos are about 15, 20 seconds. Isn't that a nice one? And there are several other ways. So I basically went backwards because I like to end with the best last. And these, like I said, only take a couple of minutes as will the rest. So let's look at the customized commercials. Now these are the ones you've already seen on TV, but what they're going to do is allow you to insert your branding or your contact info into these same themes. So it's gonna ask you the same questions. It's also gonna ask for that headshot. And fill in the card. 
Now it's going to say choose the commercials. Now you can select all of them. I suggest scrolling through, looking at each of them and deciding if you want them all or if you just want to pick a different one every week to utilize. So I'm going to click on this one and it tells you what it's about. It's 18 seconds long. You've probably seen it on TV. It's got a comical effect to it. And you are now going to build that particular scene. And when it finishes, you're going to see you can do the exact same download, copy, post, email, etc. Hey, did we do that termite inspection? That discount agent said we didn't need to. So that is just one of all those themes that you could choose from by utilizing the customized commercial template. And it's really powerful. And think about this, between this and this one, you can be sending or posting a commercial every day. So now let's look at what a custom video listing might be like. For every listing you get, you might want to create a custom listing video and let your homeowner know that you have this capability and that is unique to you at Remax. I'm filling in the exact same information. You'll get through it very quickly. And now what's asking you to tell something about the listing. So I just added the house address and I might say something like there's a virtual open house this Saturday. And here you can register from my Zoom link. And I'm gonna make note that I will be available by phone during that virtual open house. Then it's gonna say upload some photos up to three of the property. So let's pick, I should have a couple of pictures in here. This one and open it. Oh, I wanna fix it. I wanna make sure I space it right. And I might have an interior shot somewhere here. And I let them know I'm okay with that one. And if I have a third, I'll even upload that. Here we have one of the kitchen. So now you've updated three photos and you now wanna add some features about the house. What to, can you tell people about this house? Is it a smart home? Does it have great light? Is it in a prime location? And again, you get to choose three for this chime and look at all the music you get to choose from. Let's go with Key Rock and create this video. So for every one of your listings, won't your seller be excited when you shoot this off to them and say, I'm gonna be sending this today and posting it on social media. Why don't you take a look? Cause look at again, all the things you can do with it. just a, such a fan of this page because of all of the types of marketing you can create within just a few minutes. And now finally, this is the one I'm going to conclude our webinar with. Again, something to send to everybody on your list and let them know that you're the one that sent it and we are all in this together.
forgot to put my information in when I showed you that. Sorry about that. I'm going to go back and do it just to make sure. I just played it, but you'll get the idea. Here again is where it all goes. And it'll look even better the next time I play it. So it's the exact same process for everyone. You can even add your personal message and you'll see it populate here. And now if you're all set, process it and you'll get a more personalized look at the very important We're Here for You video. And there we have it, ladies and gentlemen. That does conclude our webinar for today. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found some real useful information in the tools. And like I said, I will be sending anybody who registered for the webinar a follow-up email with a link to the recording, as well as a copy of the resource guide that I went through and demonstrated all those links that you are able to click through to get a, a head start on grabbing all of these wonderful tools for your own use. So again, I would like to make sure uh, that I say, I wish you all well, please enjoy our holidays and take care of those you love. Have a wonderful day, everybody. I hope to see you in person soon. <music>